This is the Greener Gardens Greenhouse. It is a kit greenhouse from the Greenhouse in the Snow out of Alliance, Nebraska. It is a geothermal greenhouse that is built four feet into the ground and it utilizes passive solar heat in conjunction with the geo air system. The geothermal tubing system runs in a 250 foot loop four feet beneath the ground. Each tube is four foot in diameter and it's run with a 10 inch squirrel cage fan that sucks the air from inside of the greenhouse and pushes it through those tubes and when it, run, when it comes up, it comes up at a steady temperature of about 32 degrees. This is done by allowing that heat to run through the earth under our frost line. Um, we grow a lot of different things in here from tropical trees to tropical fruits. We have Valencia orange, mandarin orange, caracara orange, Meyer lemons, papaya trees, dragon fruit, and passion fruit. We also have pomegranates in our front room, which is our cold room, and it's like a buffer between what our climate really is in winter and what the climate becomes in the growing room. This last winter was pretty cold, about a negative 35 degrees, and the lowest this front room got was 20 degrees Fahrenheit. And inside the growing room, the lowest temperature was about 40 degrees. We discovered a tropical root knot nematode. So it's not native to our soils or our climate. Um, it's frequently found in Florida or the more tropical to subtropical regions. So right now we're working on addressing that issue organically. We are preparing for an anaerobic soil disinfestation. Anaerobic soil disinfestation is similar to soil solarization. However, in the anaerobic soil disinfestation, you send the soil into a state of anaerobicity um, by incorporating high amounts of carbon source. The carbon source we will be using are wheat mids and molasses. It's then tarped and sealed with soil around the perimeter of the bed that will be planted in, and we'll let that bed rest for about four to six weeks. Our goal is to encourage alternate and organic greenhouse growing methods. All of our produce and fruit is donated to local food pantries and we stand as a free resource to help troubleshoot any issues that other growers or greenhouse owners have and we try to do so as organically and economically as possible.